So the video that you just watched showed the animals in the bus um, using a map to find a route to the basketball court. So we're going to use our reflections workbook and we're going to open to page 41 and we're going to um, follow a route to um, look at the animals at the zoo. So at the top, um, go ahead and write your first name and your last name. And I'm going to write Snowy Cat up here. That's my helper. And then today's date, we're, we're May 14th, 2020. So you write the five and a little dash, the number 14, which is the one first and a little dash, and two zero two zero two thousand twenty. 2020. Okay, so follow a route. So the first thing I want you to do is I want you to take a blue crayon and I want you to write a big R down at the bottom of this pillar right here, at the bottom of your a root map. That stands for right. And then if you're going then you can take your red crayon, find your red crayon, you're going to put an L on the other side here, and that's going to stand for left. So those are two direction words we want to use when navigating this map, okay? So then you're going to take your eraser right here. You're going to help your pencil travel this route for you. So first, you're, you're going to start at the entrance to the zoo that was right here on this path, and I want you to go to the animal that's nearest to you, and that would be what do you, what's nearer, the tiger or the bird? If you look here, the amount of space in between, the bird is closest. So go ahead and, and move your eraser towards the bird, okay? And then um, go ahead and find a green crayon because you're gonna color the bird green. So that's the first animal that we're gonna visit in the zoo today, okay? Once you're finished coloring the bird, Okay, you've, you've um, spent a little time at the bird encounter and you're going to go straight again and then make an immediate right and travel down this path, go straight and stop. And then you should be facing the tiger. There's a tiger right there. So go ahead and take your orange crayon out of the box and you're going to color that little tiger right there. Okay, so the tiger is... Now imagine you're in the zoo and the tiger is in front of you. If you turn around, what animal is behind you? What animal is behind you? So you're facing this way, you turn around and face that way, and you've got the giraffe. So go ahead and color your giraffe yellow, okay? So you're gonna spend some time then looking at the giraffe. So then you're going to head back out towards the left, turn right and, and head on up and then make an immediate left again. And you should be facing the monkey. Okay, the bird's gonna be behind you. You're gonna be facing the monkey. Go ahead and color your monkey brown. So you're facing the monkey, the bird is behind you. You're gonna head, turn around, head, head right, and then head, and then make a um, left, turn up, keep going straight, and then you're going to turn a little bit off to the right and turn around, and the animal in front of you is going to be the elephant. So go ahead and use your gray crayon and color the elephant, okay? and then you're gonna turn around, head back, and then go to the path to your left, and then right there is your um, zebra, and you can get your pink crayon and color your zebra pink. Okay, so now you're all done. You've looked at all the animals at this zoo, so you're gonna turn around and head back home out of the zoo entrance. Okay. All right, thank you for helping me follow the route through the zoo today. Go ahead and give yourself an exit ticket at the top.